Welcome to A New You, which is focusing on the brain injured experience. Around 700,000 people in Australia have experience of a brain injury, and it's time there is wider awareness around this. Why don't you tell me about your own experience? I was out partying with some friends because I got a new job. I was leaving Melbourne on my way to say goodbye to Melbourne. I was to go out and get very drunk, which I did. And um, at the end of the night, I tried to get into three nightclubs, but I got rejected because I was too intoxicated. So I went around the back of one of them and um, I tried to jump in off the, I tried to climb up a balcony. I fell, landing on a vending machine put me in a coma for seven and a half weeks. One of the things that I've started up is actually a women's peer support group. Now women within the brain injury field um, can often sort of be not overlooked, but they're kind of quite marginalized because typically, as you'd be aware, there's more men have brain injury than women. Can you tell me what the importance of peers in the brain injury experience. Oh yeah, the best thing about COVID was it got us to reach out to all our members. So we started running a online peer group, coffee morning on Monday. While we're struggling for certain areas, we need to know people that have brain injuries. Currently, Brain Injury Matters is funded federally on a, I think it's a two yearly basis. So what we're calling the government to do is to actually fund us ongoing so that we can do the work that we do and reach the people that we need to reach.